As a contractor, you need tools to help you estimate everything from concrete and flooring to roofing and gutters. No matter what size project, Bluebeam Review can help you prepare your next bid as much as 70% faster. Review enables you to perform calibrated takeoffs and estimates from your project PDFs. First, calibrate review to any known dimension on the drawing. Make sure you test that calibration with a measurement to make certain it's correct. Now you're free to start your takeoffs using a number of different measurement tools. Length, area, perimeter, diameter, volume, and radius measurements even perform quantity counts right on the PDF. Let's start by doing a wall area takeoff by grabbing our area measurement tool. Once we measure the drawing, we can set a wall height in the depth column in the measurement panel. I can even show several measurement types by clicking on the box labeled Show All Measurements in the Properties panel. You can also customize Review's measurement tools and create your very own takeoff and estimating tool sets with unique properties that allow you to easily differentiate at a glance the various materials that you're tracking. In the Properties panel on the right side of Review, you can adjust the physical appearance of the measurement by changing its color, font, or style. Providing the measurement with a subject will come in handy for tracking in the markups list, but we'll get to that in a second. Once you have your measurement's properties set up just the way you want, you can save yourself the trouble of doing it all over again by placing it in your tool chest. With the tool chest, Review provides a location to store commonly used measurement tools and reuse them again with just one click. Within the tool chest, you can add, import, and export tool sets to share with other project team members. Review automatically tracks all of your takeoffs in the markups list, even the wall takeoffs we did earlier. But let's jump into a drawing that's got quite a few takeoffs already done. Notice that the information from these takeoffs can be found here, in a number of built-in columns such as length, width, area, and volume. You can also customize the markups list by adding or removing the columns being displayed. Or, you can add custom columns to get the most out of your measurements and takeoffs. Let's start by adding some custom wallpaper items to our existing material column. We'll start by adding wallpaper A and giving it a numerical value. Then we can add wallpaper B and do the same thing. Adding a formula column can help you generate quantity totals and calculate costs. Add a column called Totals. The type of column will be Formula. In the expression area, use existing column headings like measurement or length to illustrate the formula. It works a lot like Excel. Now you'll notice that the total column we just created appears in our markups list. Let's test the formula to make sure it works. If I return to the Materials column from earlier, I can double-click on the line item to see our option and then select one of the wallpaper items we added a little bit ago. Notice that when I make the selection, Review automatically calculates the material cost in my Totals column. But what if you're not doing a measurement takeoff? What if you're counting the number of individual items in a plan? Well, use Review's visual search capability to identify all instances of an object in a document, then use the count feature to count all of the items discovered during the search. Draw a rectangle around whatever object you wish to search for and select the search field. You can search on your current page, whole document, or even an entire folder. Now that Review has searched for the object, you can review the results. Select each one individually in the results list or check all at the top of the search panel. Once they're selected, you can choose to highlight, underline, or use the count feature to count your search results. In addition, you can change their properties and give them a subject for tracking in the markups list. Lastly, you may want to create a report of all the takeoffs in the markups list. You can easily summarize this information to a number of applicable formats, 
CSV, XML, or PDF. CSV can be viewed in Excel. However, some customers like to have a more visual connection between the drawing and the data, and this is where a PDF summary is ideal. Now that the PDF summary is generated, notice that each line item is hyperlinked back to the original drawing. Review now makes it easier than ever to move from a paper-based to a PDF-based takeoff process, allowing for accurate and competitive estimates that are vital to your company's success. For additional information, please check out our training page on Bluebeam.com.